Welcome to State of Tech. Let's take a look at how to use the S Pen with your Note 5. So if I pull out the S Pen from the bottom right hand corner of my device, it invokes Air Command and allows me to quickly access some options such as Action Memo, Smart Select, Screen Write, S Note, and then I can add in my own shortcuts. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on Add Shortcuts, and I can literally add a shortcut to any app that's on my device. So if I wanted Instagram to be a shortcut, Sure enough, can have Instagram, just tap on it. If I wanted to come in here and I wanted my actual settings in there, go ahead, tap on settings. It's been added as a shortcut. And now when I come back out into Air Command, notice Instagram and settings are now there. So I can set two custom apps into my quick settings here in the Air Command. Now if I tap on Instagram, guess what? It's going to open up Instagram and I can use my S Pen to go ahead and fill in my text and go ahead and type in all my information. Now if your pen is out and if you're not even using it, say I'm still swiping on the screen with my finger, notice over here in the right hand side of the screen I have my little air command button and if I highlight my pen over it, that's when it becomes active. I can't actually press on that button without the pen. So notice now I'm trying to press on that button with my finger and it's not working. I'm going to have to press that with the pen and then it opens up air command. I can tap and hold on this button with the pin, however, and I can actually move it around the screen or remove it from the screen like I would an app icon. So now I've moved it over to the left hand side of the screen. Now within Air Command, I can tap on the settings icon down here and I have some Air Command settings such as my shortcuts. Do I want the floating icon? Do I want it to automatically turn on when I unlock the S Pin? If I turn this off and I put my S Pin back into my device, and now pull the S Pen out, Air Command will not show up. But notice I have a notification at the top of the screen, S Pen was detached. Now to get Air Command to show up, I'm gonna to need to physically click the button on my S Pen when it's active, and Air Command will show up. But I can always turn that back on in the settings itself. Now there are some S Pen specific settings in your device. So come into these settings, we're gonna come over to Device, and then tap on S Pen. I can use Air Command, which is the actual Air Command that we just went over through in the other settings menu. Air on view. So that way whenever I highlight over something, I can kind of see what's going to be on that date. So they're giving me an idea on the calendar and my photos and a video. And even when I scroll down lists, I can highlight the pin at the bottom. And even highlighting over links will give me a preview of the link. So that's really cool, and I can turn that on or turn it off if I wanted to. But again, this is only going to be something when I have the pin out. Now my draw pin input is on. I can go ahead and turn that on or off. So you see hover the S pin over text area, and then tap on the button to use handwriting pad. I can turn on text suggestions. And we saw that earlier when I was in Instagram. I could have used my handwriting. I have a pointer, so notice that on the screen there's that little blue circle that kind of moves around. That's the actual S Pen letting me know that there's a pointer on the screen. I can turn that off and now that my pen is highlighted over the screen, you won't see a pointer. I have screen off memo, S Pen alerts, pen detection, and the sound and vibration for when I'm using the pen. Now S Pen alerts is really, really handy. So if I happen to leave my pen on my desk and I get up to leave to go to lunch or leave for the day and my pen is not in my phone, my Note 5 will actually alert me that my pin is no longer in my device and it's going to remind me to go pick it up. Now pin detection, this will turn off pin detection when the, it is attached and can extend my battery life. So that way when my pin is actually inserted into the device, it will no longer automatically detect and turn on air command when I unlock the S pin from the device. So you see, look, I inserted the pin and then opened it up and now air command has been invoked. Now what's really, really, really awesome is this screen off memo. So if I insert the pin back into my device and I were to lock my screen and before I even touch anything else, if I remove the pin, it's going to come in and allow me to write a memo directly on my screen. So if I needed to remember real quickly to pick up some milk, I'll just write up, pick up milk on the way home. Now it's pretty horrible handwriting, but what I can do now is tap save and it's going to save it into my notes and I'm brought back to my regular lock screen. So that's really handy if I just want to quickly take out the pen and draw a note. Now notice I can pull down my notifications, 
My screen off memo has been saved as an action memo in S note. And now I can see that note that I took on my lock screen with my device off is now in my S notes. And now I see this little note up here at the top of the screen. That's my S note that I actually made. So there's a few different ways to access that. This has been a general overview of how to use the S pen. And for more Galaxy Note 5 tips, be sure and visit stateoftech.net.